Hey guys, welcome back to another Can I Fix It video. Once again, we have a Asus Zenbook laptop. This one's a little bigger than the last one I did. The model number is UX303U. And if you remember, the last one was an i5 model. This is i7 and I think the screen is bigger as well. I got this on Facebook Marketplace and I got two Asus laptops for $120. The guy who sold it to me said that this one keeps restarting. So let's see what's going on. Okay, so I do not have the charger for this. So I'm gonna get my power supply and come in with 19 volts. Yeah, so 19 volts, 3.42 amps. Okay, so I've set it to 19 volts. Let's find a ground point here. Take one of these USB ports as the ground. And let's come in with 19 volts on the middle pin in the on the charging port. Okay, so it's taking one amp right now. Can't see any lights anywhere. Let me just, oh, I don't know if you can see the Asus logo is on. Okay, so like he said, it keeps restarting. Okay, something different is happening. There's a loading bar over here. And it's working. Can you see it? It's turned on. There's a password here. I'm gonna open up the laptop and charge the battery and then turn it on. Let's charge it up. I'm gonna get a ground point first. Let's just go over here. Then come in on the red wire. So it's working fine. Okay, as you can see, I restored the whole windows and it's all working. Let me show you the specs. It's a Asus UX303UB i7 processor. It has 8 GB of RAM and there's a 256 GB SSD in there. And I've checked everything, the speakers, USB ports and everything. They all seem to work fine. So I got a new charger for the laptop. This is it. Let me plug it in, the blue light is on and when we connect it, there's no stable connection here. So it's plugged in at the moment but it's showing it's not because when I move it around and when I hold it over here, now it's charging. But as soon as I let go, it goes back to battery. So there's a loose connection over here. So what I'm gonna do is open this up again and check the motherboard and see if anything's wrong with the charging port area. Okay, it's opened up, but I can't see the charging port properly from this side. What I'm gonna have to do is take the motherboard out. Hey guys, quick announcement. If you're enjoying this video so far, please give it a like and subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. It would really help my channel grow and I can keep uploading more videos. Okay, enjoy the rest of the video. That's the charging port and can you see the plastic has broken off around? If you take a look here, this side the plastic is missing. Okay, so first what I'm gonna do is add some more solder to these legs and make it a little stronger around the area.
Okay, that looks good. Now let's see what's happening with this plastic piece. Okay, I'm gonna try and weld them back together. And the part that's missing here, I found it on the mat. I'm gonna see if I can use my soldering iron to weld them back together. And then add some hot glue around it to keep it strong. Okay, that turned out better than I expected it to. That's how it looks now. Okay, now what I'm gonna do is melt some hot glue in here and then quickly put the motherboard down there. I've already routed the keyboard uh, ribbon cable here. So let's get on with that. I'm just taking off the excess hot glue that's seeped through. Okay, now I'm going to put it all back together. 